First thing I noticed about Justin was his, he has a beautiful smile. I don't think there was like a moment where I was like, and there it is, I'm in love. It was a very slow progression of like little things that would drop in. He'd be like, oh, I, I love that about that person. I love that about that person. And it just, it, they all sort of cumul accumulate into this, you know, what, what our love is now. Love you. I love you. I feel uh, like we're in therapy. I know. <laughs> Growing up in New Mexico for me was um, difficult for many reasons. I went to Catholic school and I lived in fear of being bullied because of my sexuality. There were never any conversations being had about what it is to be gay. It was very taboo. Um, you know, obviously I think things are a little different now. I think there's that show like Modern Family and like Lee Help because we're normalizing something that a lot of people seem to have a stigma about and it's in your living room and it's not a big deal. And then, of course, you know, with everything that's happening in New Mexico right now, it just seemed like a no-brainer. We had to be here to, to, to lend our voices to it and to bring as much attention that I, I possibly can bring to it. You know, I'm in a very lucky position where I'm on a show that a lot of people watch. And, like, if I can come here and sort of shine a spotlight on, on what's happening here, that's, that's very powerful for me. So it's like we're back in Albuquerque. I'm excited to have some green chili, to, to be now on stage in front of all of you behind a podium, talking about marriage equality, it, it's truly mind-blowing. Everyone knows what marriage is. It's a simple thing that everyone understands, and I, I don't want to have to sit down and explain piece by piece with different fragments of, well, this is what it means financially for us, this is what it means like with tax reasons, like, this is how we're different from you. I, I want to be married just like everyone else is. We are committed to, to taking a stand for marriage equality until we have it nationally. The work doesn't stop until it's over.